So for me, this is not about, I, I agree, this is not a trans issue. This is a human issue. This is a, a readiness issue. Um, this is about people. It's not about putting more labels on anybody other than that. These are soldiers, right? We show up to work every day. I want you there on time. I want you in the right uniform, right place. And you have to be ready to go to work. And they are. Nothing else matters. Um, so when I talk to other people, and they talk to me about Captain Peace, because there are a few people who know uh, Captain Peace, I think maybe more than a few, uh, <laughs> what her situation is at work, um, they, they kind of look at me, and I, I got this uh, uh, probably two days ago from someone who kind of gave me a look, and it's like, I don't understand. And I'm like, she's the best captain that I have worked with in the last decade. And I, I mean that. She is. Um, I would, if I were to deploy, she'd be the first one I'd pick up. And I'm sorry, because I know your family wouldn't want to hear that, but, <laughs> but you'd be the one I'd take with you. Um, our job, our mission, is to create a lethal army that can fight and win the nation's wars. And I take soldiers to do that. I take effective soldiers to do that. So it's not a trans issue. It's a readiness issue. And I don't know if you've noticed, but they've got a fighting spirit in there. Um, and I, that's exactly what we want. That's why, that's why Jen is as good as she is. That's why Captain Cook is as good as he is. Right? That's what we want. And so when I talk to my peers and I, I chat with them, I don't talk about... Uh, I don't, I don't know how to talk about trans other than just to say that they're, she's a great officer. She's just a person. So that's, I'll leave it right there.